cats have finally made their way into Atlas, so I thought I would do a quick video explaining how to tame them, what kind of food they like, and some of the extra features that come with being a pirate who owns a cat here on Atlas. If you are looking for cats, you should probably head to a Freeport Island because that's where I have been finding all of my cats. And you'll notice that they're extremely shy and they'll jump if you scare them, so you do need to sneak up on them to get anywhere near enough to tame. And once you do get a cat cornered, not only are you going to have to sneak up on it, but you're going to have to lay down in order to feed it. So as far as food goes, I tried taming this cat with just regular old fish, and it did work, it just seemed to take quite a bit of time to do, so I decided to switch to prime fish meat. This is not the optimal way to tame cats. Um, I'll show you how I did my second cat in the next clip, but I did end up getting her, and now she will sit on my shoulder. There is no shoulder buff as far as I know. I was kind of hoping that the cats would have a new unique shoulder buff, but it's okay because they have a secondary feature that we'll get to a little bit later in the video. But first, I will show you how I caught my second cat and how it was so much easier than the first. And as you can see here, the answer to the easier way to tame cats is to just drop a cage on them and then you can lay down and feed the meat so they can't really roam away from you. Uh, if you accidentally go into crouch, they will run away. So you have to stay prone the whole time as you feed them. So this is definitely my much easier for me instead of having to run around like a crazy woman after a cat that wants nothing to do with me. So they do stay in the cage, they do not glitch out of the cage. I don't think I placed it in the best place I could have, so uh, probably open space would be much easier than squished between two rocks, but I do eventually get the cat in the end, and it's a male, so I can actually try breeding the two cats that I have. I'm not sure about the biomes you need when you tame them uh, to breed them, but I can test that out and maybe do a video on that too. So now I have a male and female cat to bring with me back to my island. It really wasn't that bad. At first I was a little bit stumped about having to go prone in order to tame them. But all in all, we got it done. So next thing I wanted to talk about is the hunting feature. You can tell your cat to hunt for bugs, uh, rodents, or fish, and they will go into that position you just saw there, the little pouncing position, for a minute or two until eventually they come up with whatever they were hunting for. So in this case, I told Luke to hunt for bugs, and now he has an ant that we can eventually take from him. And when you do take the creature, fish, ant, whatever he gets from him, as you can see, I got the carotenoid there. This is really useful if you are out on an island you're not sure of and you need some fish or you need some carotenoid. You can always just send your cat hunting for it instead of going and finding it yourself. Um, I have not tested out the combat with the cats yet. I haven't tried killing anything with cats on my shoulder or letting them roam around me and killing something. I will have to test that out and get back to you all on that. But for the most part, I'm really happy with the addition of cats. They're pretty cute. I'm excited to breed them and see what kittens look like. As I said, I will also get back to you all on the biomes that cats need to be bred in, as well as how hard it is to breed cats compared to everything else in the game. And of course, as Grapeshot Games mentioned, we will be able to have cats with hats. So I have the new Atlantean helm on my cat, which was not cheap, by the way. So she's got that going on. And then of course, you can put all of the other costumes over an armor piece so that your cats can have hats too. We still have plenty left to discover about cats, I'm sure, but this was just a quick helpful video on how to tame, find, and feed the cats, as well as their special features, and of course, ability to wear hats. So I really hope this was helpful. If this was helpful for you, then please consider leaving it a like and also subscribing to my channel if you have not already. I like to play a lot of games like Atlas, as well as MMORPGs and other early access titles in development. I recently opened up my Patreon account, so if you are interested in some bonus content or just having some extra community perks, please feel free to check out my Patreon page. I really appreciate all of the help I've gotten so far. It lets me continue running my Atlas server as well as looking into a new Atlas server, which I would like to get started. It'll be a two by two grid, so four grid spaces um, with PVE and PVP features included. So I'm gonna try getting that up and running. In the meantime, I'll keep playing with cats. I hope this video helped everybody. And as always, I hope you all are enjoying your games. I will see you all in the next one.